And welcome in Chef Sam Choi hey, and John Benary. Hello, hello, hello. Aloha, Chef. Thank you for being Thank here. You. Wow, Thanks, John. So good. Oh, they're from In the Kitchen and yep. last night's episode. So awesome. Out yes. in Makakilo with Kathy, John, Rust, and also the kids. Okay, so tell us all about that experience. Well, I tell you what, the house, the view was spectacular. Oh, yeah. They had a great place and, and great food. Yes, and they had a lot of nice things in the refrigerator. That's you know? the big thing that you just well, go in, surprise these people, and whatever they have in their fridge and their cabinet. That's what you use to make these awesome meals. You know, and as you can see on the footage there, you know, they had some leftover noodles that I turned into a pancit. Pancit! You know, not pancy, pancit. It, well, it was a fancy pancit. Well, you know, because they had a little lop chong, they had a little bacon. Not the real traditional, but you know what? It was amazing. And you've already got a little bit of that ready. Though. Well, because you. Wait, 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 what is that? Where? Oh, John, you didn't carry. Oh! You actually got me. Okay, so <laughs> Chef Sam Choi already was chopping up some of the carrots, onions. What else do we have chopped uh, up here? I'm going to have you stir it in, but anyway, okay. we have a little bit of bacon. All right. Bacon, first oh, the, bacon. the bacon. Everything is better with bacon. Ooh, yeah. And fizzle. And I got some garlic, garlic. You know? Who doesn't like garlic? Bacon and garlic. I, we, I remember this. We didn't use any oil, too, because right? yeah. we're using the bacon oil. Right. Oh, that makes and, sense. Yeah, and then I don't want to add the onions yet because I want it kind of like al dente. Okay. And then, uh, Chong. Lob Chong. Who doesn't love Lob Chong? You like Lob Chong? Of course. Okay. And it, you're saying you want to add in the onions later to keep them crispy. Don't onion it yet. I'm not onion it. But just kind of like right when you want to feel like you're going to give yourself about two or three more minutes. Okay. Because you want your vegetables kind of like al dente, mm. which is kind of like still crispy but cooked. Right. Oh, this smells so good. Yeah, it's good, huh? I'm such a carnivore, so I would just be happy just eating this straight. Yeah. <laughs> oh, so the yeah. lob chong, people got to realize it's cooked already. So it's a sausage that's cooked. All right. So you really don't want to overcook it. The only one oh, you want to cook is the bacon. So I'm just going to go ahead. Very nice, John. When did we exactly throw that? That goes in? quick. So now you're going to see what we do on the show. Okay. Where we've taken the leftovers and then we add the color to it right here like this. So you scoop your carrots into that. Okay. And they had their carrots and onions as well? No, no, not yet, not yet. Just the carrots. Just the carrots and all the rest of the leftover meat. The meat cannot leave any of those. No, 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 no. Do you put any seasoning or do well, you, or is this bacon, all just... Bacon's got salt. Okay. Right? Yes. And then cut me some gailan, the other green vegetables there. If it's farm raised, you got to really double wash, triple wash. Right, right. You got to kind of wash them individually. And then I like to make a solution of a little vinegar and water. Oh, and I want to add just a little seasoning because we got that little bit. Of course, Aloha, show you. Yeah, yeah, a little bit right here. And a little stock just to kind of like hop. What's your, what's, what, what did you do? Though? How did you do that? Uh, just water, water and the dog. Yeah, that's it. Oh, okay. That's okay. pretty simple. Yeah. There you go. So are we almost there, Chef? How's this yeah, looking? Yeah, perfect. We're, we're coming along. This smells just, so yeah. good. Okay, so so these all can go in right now. Okay, perfect. All right, uh, so we're adding in everything now. Wow, okay, the we're onions done. as well, and we're done. Well, and well, so, well the noodles. Chef, yeah. are the noodles pre-cooked as well? Yes, the noodles are already cooked. Okay, so so what did the family think about the dish? What did well, the kids especially Well, you know, I'll tell you think? what, who doesn't love noodles in Hawaii? You no know? one. So they loved it. You know, we did a couple other dishes. I mean, the show is just exciting. <laughs> And we got everything from their refrigerator. Wow. Okay, and as we're finishing this up, sh Chef, we just throw in the noodles, yeah, and eggs just, on top? Yeah, eggs going to be mixed in with it. Sure. But we're going to just do it like this. I'll show you how we do it real quick. Oh, perfect. And then, John, yep. your, your chopped eggs, can you just put it right in, in, in that right now? This really makes the concept really another level. Oh, yeah. Takes yeah. it up a notch. Yeah, it does. Not only does it add a different flavor, but also a really nice creamy texture. Yeah, exactly. You know, and you just kind of like, you know, swoosh it around. Okay, perfect. Okay, okay so right towards the camera. Yeah. There we go. Look at how oh, that looks amazing good. that looks. Oh, wait, fantastic. Thank you so much. You guys, don't forget, wait, wait, wait. Uh, In the Kitchen with Chef Sam Choi and John Veneri every Sunday at 6.30. You're not going to want to miss it. And yeah. I'm about to dig into this. Just a little boiled mm. eggs right there, like that. Amazing. Look All at right, that. stay tuned, you guys. More is coming up on Living 808. I want to get some of this meat. There we go.